Okay, welcome everyone. So I'm going to be walking us through um, the Coursera. Okay, how to get started. All right. Please do remember, as I said, the first thing first is, please, you would be sent an email. All right. Um, once you register, we're going to send you invites, four emails like this. Can you see this? Let me just click here. Click. Okay, you're going to be sent four emails. And this is into four courses. So you have introduction to FET, whole class, activity design, and implementation of FET activities. Okay, so please, I beg you to, when you click here, when you go in, you click join, join the, the group on Coursera. If you have not opened up a Coursera account, please follow the direction in the PDF document. Let me try to open up the PDF document. Where is it? Uh, in the PDF guide, please read this. Read this before you start. Okay? Because once you... Sorry, it's loading my internet. All right, do not join the course through... Um, you know, when, you know the, the method where it says use your Google account and you click there and it's... No, don't. There's a way... There's a conflict with that in Coursera. Register a new uh, account, normally creating your password. Are you seeing it? Do you see this? Do not join via Google. Don't do that. It's going to start, um, you know, giving you a lot of problems. So create an independent, as in create the account independently from clicking on that uh, sign up via Google. You understand what I mean? You know, you know that tab where it says sign up via Google, or your Facebook, or, or another type of uh, a TikTok account. No, do not use that. Go through the process of uh, creating your, uh, putting in your email, creating your password. So please, very important. Okay, so you don't have issues. Please make sure you read this document carefully. If you're using your phone, there's this method you can use because it's better you work uh, on this on the laptop system. But if you don't have a laptop, Look at this. You go to the three dots on the top right corner of your phone. All right. Then select desktop site mode. This will help you. All right. Manage your activities on the Coursera website. All right. So going back now. So please make sure you read this um, document and it has FAQ on any problems you encounter. The solutions are down here. Any problems you encounter, you, you're going to see the solutions here. Okay. And if you don't find any solution here, you can always um, send a message on the WhatsApp group when it's open. So coming back here. So when you click on, where, where, where was I? Sorry. So we're coming back here. When you click on join group, so it takes you there. Now, this is the way, as I said, so you create your account, you join in introduction, come to whole class now, you click join. All right, come to activity, click join, come to imp implementation, click join. Why am I saying this? So that, um, you know, if you just join introduction, when you go to your Coursera dashboard, which we are going to go, go into soon, it will just show into introduction. Then it will start recommending these other three ones for you to enroll. If you click enroll in your Coursera dashboard, it's going to start asking you for money. So please click from here so you you are on the free package all right you know Coursera charges 69 dollars uh, per month so please um this has been provided uh, free of charge by the university of colorado boulder so please do make sure you join immediately don't don't just do this and forget then go enroll later all right it will start asking you for fees and the process of you getting back to the free version again is quite strenuous and stressful, okay? So please um, let us quickly enroll in each and every one of them immediately because I also emphasize it here. Immediately, you, you immediately, immediately, kindly join all of them immediately, okay? So when you, yes, so when you are into this, then... When you come to your dashboard, this is the way the Coursera dashboard will look like. On the phone, it will be a bit, you know, smaller and compact. When you come to my learning, you would now see all the four courses in here. In your learning, your overall progress, everything. You are to start with introduction first. 
okay? From now to next week, you are to do introduction to FET and you are to do whole class. All right, yeah, I forgot to mention something. Some people do complain, oh, I just, um, I just, I just see only implementation activity design. I can't find introduction. I can't find whole class in my email. Once you've received one, you will receive, definitely you have the rest. All you need to do is just search, search your entire, um, you know, box. Um, you can just search FET, you know, in your entire mailbox, just search and it will bring it up. All right. Or you can search your spam. Okay, that's uh, for people that, uh, you know, I know of some client, of some people that always delete people or trash things and all that. Okay, please search your trash, uh, trash box also. So you can just come here, search FET, and it will bring out everything on FET for you. Okay, so that's the way to get, maybe it, it came in, you know, scattered format. It didn't come for at once, all right, for people with that issue. Okay, so now. Come in here, all you need to do now is just enter. Just click here. It takes you to the course. Give it some few minutes. Okay? Don't be bothered about this time zone. Just close this. Don't be bothered about the time zone. Close it up. Just close it, okay? All right? So you are to go through all this. All this. Just start from just start from it just read through you know it's like uh how am i gonna put it? it's like a book but with several it's been arranged well for you with several things you know brief introduction website tour there are videos just click here you can see one minute six minutes just go through each one of them step at a time play with simulation you selecting your simulation just one at a time one at a time all right Go to model two, you know, every, this is course one. So these are the models in course one, you know, just go in there one at a time and, you know, follow the instructions, just read through. Okay. Look at model three. Can you see this? Everything about the simulation, it just gives five minutes, two minutes, just go there. There are practice quiz to, to, I, I don't want to jump. I, let me just open everything. I wanted to jump. Okay. Go to model four. This is where you do your selecting seat, um, selecting sim assignment. Okay. So you can see practice finding activities. You know, you do the practice quiz here, selecting sim. You come here, please um, neglect this due date. Okay. All right. So here you come here. Okay, I was I received overdue assignment. Okay, so yeah, so look look at this now. So here, this is where you download the document that you are to use to do this homework, this particular assignment. So you download. Please do read through this, read through all instructions. Just read through it. Okay, so you click here. It opens up. You download on your system. Okay on your phone and you work on it it's uh -huh. so this is a template all right you're already given an example this is selecting sim as assignment okay so you pick your sim pick you know create your three goals the course has taught you how to you know create all those all this all right and you know so fill in everything your course fill in everything here and when you are done, you save, you can save in your name, all right, which is better and preferable, all right, so save in your name, then you come to my submissions, oh, nine minutes, okay, just put your name, all right, yes, you understand, in your submissions, you know, you put the title of, of your, of your, of your assignment, then you upload, this is where you upload, and, you know, you click here, then from there, when you submit it will take you to review all right because you have to review about three people all right this is where the Coursera platform helps out so three people is going to review your work if you don't do well once two people kick off your work and says you don't do well then it means you didn't do it well so you have to redo it and submit again and also you to try to you all oh, you have to is a must everyone will review you review three people three people other three people will review your work okay so you might ask how do i know how to review in reviewing your pairs there's a rubric 
okay? There's a rubric you use, all right? So you preview it, okay? And it will tell you, you know, when you want to review, did this person did do this? You tick, tick, you check. You know, you open that particular file to check did the person put um, learning goals? Did he select a sim? Did it? Uh, did, a, did the educator put um, the grade, the class um, grade, the age grade, the, the you know, and all that? So you would tick it off. If it's if he doesn't do, if he or she didn't do that, you also you know let the person know. Oh, you need to edit this. You know, you score the person instead of a one, it should be a, a um, you know a zero. So please do review okay so let's go back we go back here so that's in module 4 we come to module 5 so there are other things for you to go through here all right that's on equity framework you come to module 6 okay nothing uh, just going through all this finding activities more on FET come to module 7 and you are done all right and when you are done Please be patient. It takes like three to five days. Others have to review your work first. All right. And when you, you, your work is reviewed and everything is good in check, three people, you know, tick you good scores, then your certificates will be generated for you. It will automatically be sent to your email. So you have to do this. And after, when you're done with um, this, then you go back. for an easier way to go back if i do this okay okay so you go back to your learning all right then you go to whole class whole class with fit okay i don't want this video to be long it's already 12 minutes I think 15 minutes will stop so close this don't let this time timer stuff um, disturb you so whole class with fed all right so this is on um strategies you, you can use to implement fed okay so module one is on what um you know fed whole class strategies you know it's taking you through this you just go through all this active learning with fed in whole class activities please just read through all this go to module two okay here now it now breaks down the pedagogy this is whole class inquiry all right everything on whole class inquiry is here please go through it you see um, the template examples all right go to model two all right this is interactive lecture demonstration all right go to model four this is concept questions all right then in model five all right so here you are to submit you are to pick two select two all right two strategies and work on them so here this is where you submit your assignment work on you either select whole class you either select interactive or you select what concept questions okay so whichever of the three two you picked from the three you go in and you submit so let's say you you picked whole class inquiry all right you you know click here to download the templates for planning a whole class inquiry, you know, you select your sim. A sample has been done for you. So you to pick a topic, pick your goals, you know, and how you, you intend to manipulate the sim in your classroom. All right. So when you are done with that, you come to your submission here and you upload, you upload your document after you've worked on it. You upload it here, you know, put your uh, project description upload. After uploading, you review review your peers you have to review three people so others also review you and reviewing is very important because that's the grading um you know that's where you're being graded all right so um i don't want this video to be long so if when you are done with this then if you're picking interactive lecture demonstration you go into it if it's concept questions you go into it so this is how you navigate um introduction all right, this is how you navigate introduction to FET also and also whole class what strategies. This is how you navigate those two courses. So those two courses you are to finish before Wednesday. So we go into activity 
design. All right, quickly, let me quickly enter here. So we go into activity design. And after activities design, then we do now implementation. All right, so thank you. And um, I hope um, this video would help almost everyone. I'm sure it should help you. If you have any questions further, you can drop on the WhatsApp group. So you have to do introduction to FET, whole class um, with FET. Then after that, um, after a Wednesday webinar together, that's the second synchronous session, then you go into activity design. Then after that, the third synchronous section, we go into implementation of your FET activities. Okay. So as I said, don't be bothered about the timer. All right. Don't be bothered about the timer. And uh, any other questions, please feel free to drop your message in the WhatsApp group. And please do go through this document before starting. It is quite important. All right. Thank you. And see you in the group. I am close, close by. Okay.